Hey guys, just making a quick video to help you set up and know how to set up a budget in the Easy HOA software. So what you wanna do is you wanna log into the management software and then you wanna first come over here to the left-hand side under the accounting menu, main menu uh, section. And the first thing you wanna do is go to the chart of accounts page. So when you click on that chart of accounts page, this is where you need to set up your income accounts and your expense accounts. So this is the first step before you can create the budget. So for example, under the income chart of accounts section, um, I've already created one right here, a sub account called HOA dues. So that's just gonna allow me as uh, deposits get deposited into the HOA bank account, I can now classify them as an HOA due. If I've got other types of income, um, I can just create another sub account right here. So I might wanna create one called um, late fees, something like that. And I can just hit save. And we'll create another sub account right here under the operating income section. I want to do that same thing under the expenses over here. So I want to create a, you know, I've already created like electricity, landscaping, pool cleaning. These are all sub accounts under the chart of accounts section in the account, in the uh, software or the accounting main menu. So that's the very first step. So set up all of your uh, income and expense uh, sub accounts or accounts in the software. The next thing you're going to do after you do that is you're going to come over here again under the accounting main menu item. You're going to go to this page called budgets. And when you click on this page, you'll see a button right here at the top right says create new budget. And when you click on that, you're just going to create a title for the budget and then the budget period and then hit save and that will create the budget. I've already created one called 2024 budget. Um, I put the period as January 2024 just through the end of 2024 and I hit save and I created that. So now when I click on the name of the 2024 budget, what will happen is it's going to, as you see all those sub accounts we created for income. So we have our HOA dues, we have late fee, we have other income. Those are all gonna pop up here under this budget page. Same for expenses. If I look down here, I have electricity, landscaping, other expenses and pool cleaning. So these are all of those, um, sub accounts that we created over here under this chart of accounts page, that first step. Um, what you want to do once these expenses and income categories are created, uh, for example, this first column right here is called budget total. So under this pool cleaning category, if I click on the, uh, the number out to the right of pool cleaning under this budget total, I can set a a budget total for that pool cleaning category. So for example, if pool cleaning is $6,000 a year, I'll put $6,000, I'll hit save. And what that will do, if you see right here, it'll put 6,000 in the budget total, but then out to the right, it will divide it out. So it says 500, 500. It will divide that out by 12 for each month. And then that's how I set my budget amount for pool cleaning. So you're going to want to go ahead and do that for all your expenses, for all of your income. Oops. And then once you have all those budget amounts set, then as the transactions and in income and expenses flow into the software, you can ca categorize what the actual numbers are and be able to have a comparison. So if I come back up here to the budgets page, so I go back to my 2024 budget, the budget page out here to the very right, it says budget versus actuals. If I click on that link, this is going to bring up the budget versus actuals. So I can kind of have a comparison of where we're at with the budget amount that we put in there. Um, and then what the actual numbers are, expenses and income for the year or the month. Now it's important to note that the actual numbers for the budget come from this transactions page. So under accounting, if you click on that transaction page, um, this will have a list of all the transactions. So usually you're gonna connect uh, the accounting module to your bank account and the bank account will feed all the transactions into this page. And then so those income and expense transactions come into this page. You're gonna categorize them under uh, either an HOA due or a late fee or an electricity um, expense or, you know, whatever it is, you're going to classify them here under this page. And then as you classify them, these will become the actuals compared to the budget amounts over here 
again under that budget section. So that's how you set up the budget um, for an HOA and how you get started. If you have any questions, please just reach out to us, uh, call or email us, and we'll, we can help you with any other questions that you have. Thanks.